Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna share what I believe might be my fifth layout in my December Memories album for the year 2019. And if you have not seen the previous layouts, I'll go ahead and link the playlist for all of my December Memories layouts that I've done so far down in the description box along with the links to all of the items that I use today as well on this layout. So I am gonna be working in the Coco Daisy Traveler's Notebook insert here. And I'm mixing in, of course, my Coco Vanilla items that go really well with the Coco Daisy collection. I'm also gonna pull in some items from Close to My Heart. Now, I chose this background because it went pretty well with my photo. If I am working in an insert that already have pattern paper as the pages, I do not add my layouts chronologically. I just add it to whatever background works best with the photo. So here I'm adding a picture my life card from the Jingle Joy collection from Close to My Heart to the right page. And that right page is just a grid white page. So I went ahead and added that black and white card there. And my photo does have a very thin white border all the way around. And now I'm gonna work on my title which will go on the left page. So here I'm adding in this pattern paper, this minty green pattern paper with all of those trees on there. I'm adding that to the left page and that's where I'm gonna add my title. You can see I have warm and cozy in white foam letters on the top and bottom of that card, but I will go ahead and move that in just a little bit. I did not like how it went together with my title. So I'm gonna add in my title using those Altony Black Alphas and it says PJ Party. You can see my P and J is a little far apart, but I'll put them a little closer in just a little bit. So once I added in my title, I'm gonna work on my embellishments. Now I brought in some pieces from L Studio from 2019. I also added in some word phrases from Coco Vanilla and also some chipboard pieces from Coco Daisy. And you will see here, I move things around quite a bit until I got the look that I was going for. And once I do, I'll use my liquid adhesive to adhere all of these pieces to my layout. Now, once I'm adding in my chipboard, I always try to remove the back of the chipboard. That way I can reduce the amount of, the amount of bulk that's gonna be in this insert because these inserts, I want to make sure they stay as thin as possible so they can close and that my binding won't come apart. So I'm gonna use my Art Glitter Glue there adhere my chipboard pieces and I made a little banner using the same pattern paper I used on the left page. I'm gonna add that as well below my photo. I added a little semicircle tab that says highlight of the week. I also pulled in some hearts from L Studio in green and blue. And here I'm using some of these glittery dots from Coco Daisy. And I added two of those to the bottom of that acetate heart. Now, the acetate heart is from L Studio. I have a whole pack of acetate pieces that I'm having an issue using. It's very hard to figure out how to adhere these to your layout. I normally use maybe some staples or try to hide my adhesive behind something that I might add on top of that acetate piece. But in this case, the acetate is just gonna sit on my title card there. Now to add that on there, I'm using some glue spots. I'm gonna add one to the top and one to the bottom right of the heart. And if you look really closely in a real person, in real life, you will see the glue dot, but it does not bother me. It is clear, it's very thin, it's not raised at all, and they are small. So it worked pretty well with this. I went ahead and added two labels below my title card there where I added in some journaling, a little bit of journaling saying that this was Jaden already in his favorite pajamas for his party at school. And to pull it all together, I'm adding in some splatters using some black India ink 
And here we have my completed layout, which took no time at all to put this together. It came together really, really fast. Here I have some still shots, and I hope you guys enjoyed the process today. If you did, be sure to give me a thumbs up before you leave. And don't forget to click on that subscribe button. Come back soon and check out another one of my layouts in my December Memories album. So I want to thank you all for watching today. And until next time, bye.